All right, I got to I got to zoom in on that. Oh man. All right. You're back to the mustache. You're seventh in the country two years ago with the mustache. Are you trying to draw some power from the mustache? Um, I had one last year. Not a whole lot of people knew it, but yeah, it's part of my it's part of my game in March. I think you dyed it. It was dyed like Joel's color, like like jet black. Yep, it was jet black two years ago. Yep, yep two two years ago. Yep. Will you go back to jet black if you're able to win the MAC conference? I will. Yes, I will. Well, is that like a good luck thing? Yeah, it's definitely a good luck thing. I kind of. I think when guys have mustaches, like you see Evans, you see Cologne, they have mustaches. They're kind of, it, 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 it kind of makes you a badass a little bit. In two weeks, this is all over for you. Do you think about that a lot? I kind of do. Like these last couple of weeks, I just take a second, look around, and you know, I'm just enjoying every every minute of it. You know, I mean, the bus ride here was awesome. I mean, I think what I'm going to miss most is just the team bonding and just the practice rooms and the, the competition. You know. You have placed in the U.S. Open before, correct? Yep, eighth is place. It, are, do you think that that's something you'll pursue? Do you think you'll try and be, you know, chase chase the freestyle dream? I think so. I would think I'm going to give it a little break afterwards and then see see where I'm going to go as training partners and try and find somewhere to go. Mel and I think from Mizzou, he's given you two just, I've seen two really good matches. Mm -hmm. He hit you with that swing single. Uh, you know, he came from behind at the scuffle to beat yep. him. What do you got to do, you know, if that's, if that's who you see in the finals? Let's say you make the finals, all goes well for you. What, does anything change for you against Mellon? Uh, I just keep my pace high. Uh, third period, it's going to be hard to score those. You might get one in the first, it's going to be hard in the third. Big time got nine bent to heavyweight. Yeah. It's, it's nails, okay? They're going to actually probably have a ninth place match, which is kind of crazy. But do you look at that as an advantage for you not having to go through that brutal tournament? I think so. Um, it's a kind of a mini national tournament, if you want to call it that. So I think it's kind of an advantage for me because, hey, I'm here wrestling a couple tough guys, but, you know, I'm not wrestling a top eight ranked guy every match. You know, your pace, we talk about your pace. You got a motor, man. You absolutely get it going. You've had it ever since you're a high schooler, you yep. know. And, and you've really developed it. You know, you're average as a freshman in high school, and you, you win the state title. Yeah. Do you think your motor sets you aside and makes you the great heavyweight you are? I think it does. Um, it's what I set my, it's what I set my game plan to be. Um, I hang my hat on it every match. I'm, win, lose, or draw, I'm getting as tired as I could possibly get because I know if I get tired, that guy has to be exhausted. Joe Greenley had a black eye when I saw him last week at the state tournament. <laughs> what happened? Uh, we were actually just drilling at this point. We were doing snapping out of ties and. Somehow his, his eye just came down on my thumb, and <laughs> I grabbed my thumb, he grabbed his eye, and we are rolling around. All right. He said, you know, when you're done, it's going to be the end for him. Yep. No more wrestling. Yep. Does that make you a little sad knowing that Joe won't be on the mat anymore? Oh, uh, it's going to be hard to get him off the mat. He loves rolling around, whether it's with a 25-pounder or if it's with me. So I don't think he's going to be done for sure or for good, but... He'll start slowing down a little bit more. For keeping score and it's a seven minute match, can you beat him? Yes. You can? Yeah. Just so you know, that's on video and he'll probably watch that tonight, yeah. all right? All right, um, you got anything else for me? You know, big tournament coming up. Anything you change? Anything, you know, is there any, anything special you do for the match? Personally, it's just it's the same thing I've been doing all year. Um, it's just part of the process of becoming a national champion and, and uh, look for Ohio to win it. I think we're going to come out on top. We're wrestling tough, man. All right, J-Train, thanks for the time. Good luck tomorrow. Thanks. We'll be all over that stash, all right? Oh, yeah.